Where am I? Patrick? Squidward? Sandy? Mr. Krabs? Oh, it's cold in here. And there's dead bodies. This looks familiar to me. Hello? Is anyone here? Watermelon? <coughs> well, how convenient that an elevator is right in my sight. No way I'm getting on that, though. This door is locked. This is the exit, though. I've been here before. I remember this place. This is the exit. This is the chum bucket. Plankton. Plankton's behind this. Somebody? Plankton, are you there? Plankton? It seems like there's cameras in here, so I'm being watched by somebody, probably Plankton. This is another exit, but it's still locked. Plankton's probably locked this entire facility, the entire chum bucket. Hello? This door's locked. Probably another exit. Okay, maybe I shouldn't go in this room. I'm lost. Wait! I need to get on the elevator. There's still a ladder I can take, though. Wonder how far down the rabbit hole this goes. What's at the very top? This is roof access. I don't want to be on the roof. Why am I on the roof of the cr the chum bucket? I almost have the crusty crab. Wait a second. Plank Den. He's done a lot of remodeling to this place. That door's locked. And that door's locked. Probably two exits. Plankton's done a lot of work to this place. This place has new stuff added to it. Perhaps he turned this into a giant maze, just so I'd be confused. Hello? Someone's gotta be here besides me.
This is locked. It's just a bunch of explosive barrels. What about the end? Also locked. This is confusing. This doesn't make any sense. Well, back to the ladder. Hello? I remember this place. Earth surrenders. Ha. Ah. Ha. Ah, he still has old news articles from when the Urchids attacked. <coughs> Those are the cameras that were in that place so no one's watching me because it's empty in here but plankton's gotta be somewhere in here he's just got to there's probably nothing in there assuming this is also an exit because of the red light that keeps flashing when I try and open the door I guess I might as well just explore this room. Patrick! Patrick, are you okay? Oh, well, oh hi, SpongeBob! There's blood on your forehead. Juice. I have a juice box and some meat. Don't eat the meat. That's chum. Patrick! I have a gut of steel, SpongeBob. There's blood on your forehead, Patrick. Oh, that's cranberry juice. I tried to open another juice box earlier and I spilled it on my head. Where are we? It looks like the chum bucket, but it looks so much more different than when I remember it. Why are there cranberries underwater? Who knows? Come on, we need to find a way out of here. Every door in this entire facility, every door in the chum bucket is locked, and I don't know how to get out of here. And I'm kind of scared, Patrick. How about we use the elevator? The elevator is just the same thing I took. Follow me. I came, I think... Okay, so these are both locked. I came from over here. from this ladder. This ladder basically is the same thing as the elevator. Here. You check that place. I'll check over here for more. See, this is the kitchen. The kitchen. Stay uh, there. A, um, in the freezer. I woke up on this dead. bed. Hey, there are a bunch of dead fish in the freezer. I know. Or whatever these things are. Some they look like fish. They look like mutated fish. Probably some of Plankton's experiments like, or something. They look like crabs. They may be crabs. Maybe he's doing this to get revenge on Mr. Krabs. Who knows? Kind of look like they could, la they could latch onto your head. Come on, Patrick. We need to find a way out of here, Patrick. This is scary. How about we wait for the first floor? Sounds like a plan. Where's P Plankton even at? I don't know. Are we going back down? I want to go back up. 
I don't know. Is there another floor below this one? I think there is. Yep. There's a truck. Hey, hey, what's that one? I haven't been to that one yet. I don't think it stops at that one. Stay in the elevator, Patrick. Stay in the elevator. See okay. if you can find a way to that truck. That truck is... I woke up in that truck. I think we were beaten over the head. I was beaten over the head with a baseball bat is the last thing I remember. Or something. And I was put in that truck. Find a way into that room. I'll sit down here and explore a little bit more. Hey, SpongeBob, I found a way into the place. What place? The place with the truck. Oh, cool. Stay there until the elevator gets back down. Actually, no, wait. Go ahead and go. Is there a door up there? Uh, there's a big black hole. Go through the black hole. Okay. Uh... I'll, be, I'll be up there in a little bit. As soon as the elevator gets back down, I'll come back to the truck. Oh, no. I think Patrick may have found a way out of here. We're free. I don't even know why Plankton kidnapped us. Why does he want us as prisoners? That's just creepy. I can't, I don't know what I'm doing. I need to stay down here and wait for the elevator. Here it comes. Whew. What does this news article say? Huh. News articles. Oh yeah, the elevator. No. No, 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 no. Ah, I gotta wait for it to come down again. Fooey. I don't even know what I did. So don't... Word of advice, Spongebob. Don't get lost in the stupid... News articles. You know what? Just in case I do accidentally miss the freaking elevator again, I'm gonna get into it. Stand right by it. Come on, I know it's almost here. There it is. There it is. Alright, come on, hurry up, let me in, let me in. Alright, 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 perfect. Alright, now I just have to... Gotta squeeze my way through. I'm a sponge, I can just squeeze through this. Ow! Hey, at least I'm in. Alrighty. So, this is... I don't think this is the same truck that me and Patrick were kidnapped in. But anyway, there's that black hole Patrick was talking about. Now I can finally meet up with him and see if we can find a way out of here. I think we're free. Patrick? Where'd you go, Patrick? Buddy? Patrick? Um... Hello? Patrick? Patrick? You in here, buddy? and sure has done a lot of remodeling to this place. This doesn't even look like the chum bucket anymore. Is that a lantern? Okay. At 
least I have a lantern. Plankton, this isn't funny. Where are you? Why is there like Russian on the door or something? Patrick, where are you? I hope we don't go down a wrong tunnel. Shoot. What the heck was that? Sounded like a rat. Hello? Oh, oh, what is that? I'm just gonna leave now. I don't even know what that is. That looked like a crab. This isn't safe. Ah! Ah! Plankton, this is too much. Plankton, somebody, Patrick, Mr. Krabs. I don't even want to know what's in that water. Are you going to make me find out? Uh, Pat? I really don't want to do this. I can't swim. <laughs> There's nothing even down here. I'm gonna keep my f should I keep my flashlight on. I'm almost out of oil. Um, hello? What kind of sick stuff is this, Plankton? What did I do? Hello? A shotgun. Is that more? Sweet, I got some more oil. All right. How do I get out of here? Why do I hear cries and screams? Anyone? What's that creaking noise? Hello? 
point, Dan. This is really not funny. This is really scary. I'm not even sure if this is actually the chum bucket. What the hell? I'm not going in there. Close the door, please. This isn't right, Platon. I'm not going down there either. I'm not going in there either. Can I just leave, please? Is it possible for me to just leave this place? Can I just leave peacefully? Why are there dead bodies in here? I want to go home. Let me out. Patrick. I can't deal with this anymore. Oh, oh God. What's in these? Close. I don't want anything coming after me. Oh, oh my god! Oh, oh. Patrick! Patrick, Patrick, Patrick. Wait, I have a shotgun. Why am I so worried? Get back, filthy fish! These look like mutated fish that have had their gills and scales stripped from their bones. What has he done to you poor people? What has Plankton done to you? Plankton, this is not funny. This is crossing a line. There is a line and you are far past it. There's even boat mobiles in here and... Is that outside? I'm locked in. At least I know one thing. This is the chum bucket. That's definitely behind the chum bucket. That's the kelp forest right there. And the kelp forest is behind the chum bucket. Looks like I'm locked in here. I'm going over that rock. Well, it took me a while to get past those rocks. But at least I've done it. I think I lost my lantern, though. Where am I now? Now this looks a little bit more like the chum bucket. Not much, but it's a start. Hello? This place also looks less scary. Just based on the fact that there's no dark room or mutated fish coming after me or burnt charred fish falling out of stalls all right wait where's Karen during all this 
I gotta look for Karen. I've been through a major chunk of the chum bucket and I haven't found her. I hope Plinton didn't do anything stupid with her. Like, destroy her, pour ice cream on her. Ugh, melted ice cream sucks. Hello? What I do? Oh, I turn on the gas. Is the gas supposed to do something? I don't know. Time to see what that other room is. There's Karen. Karen. Karen, can you hear me? Karen, please, I need you to tell me where Patrick You can scan this place, right? Like, you can look for heat signatures or something? Karen? Can you at least tell me where your husband is? Where's Plankton? Karen! He can't be too far away. Maybe he's in that office. I mean, he could be anywhere. He's so small. Wait a second. I could just check where Patrick's location is. Oh, he's at the heart of the chum bucket. He's in the middle. And the chum bucket looks huge. Plankton did do a lot of remodeling to it. It's looking less like a restaurant and more like some sort of high-tech... Hello? Hey. Okay. Like I was saying, it looks less like a restaurant. It looks more like some science lab or something. Alright, I gotta get to the heart of the chum bucket. But how do I do that? Through here. Uh, Is that Patrick? Uh, Patrick! Uh, it's horrible! Horrible! Patrick, is that you? Oh, hey, SpongeBob. Hey, we got separated for like an hour. Oh. Where are we? This looks weird. I think this is like the core of the chum bucket. Well, I did. It's horrible. Plankton stuffed ice in my mouth, and then I started on the ice. And then the ice melted and turned into water, and I'm fine now. Fantastic. I was going through this really dark, creepy part of the chum bucket, and it said that you were somewhere in the middle of the chum bucket, according to Karen's research or whatever. So here you are. There's no gravity. Is there no gravity? I don't know. Oh, also, Plankton's over there. Plankton! Yes, hello there, Spongebob. Plankton, what did you do? And why are we moving? Well, see, I had one of my guards take you while you were sleeping. And, uh, well, uh... Well, what? Why are we here? Why did you kidnap us? Why did we have to go through all this really crazy torture and stuff like that? Well, <laughs> Let me be honest with you. I'm trying to test out one of my new projects. What was that? Someone just went through the teleporter. It's no big deal. Now let me explain what happened. I kidnapped the two of you because while you were asleep, I stole your blood. You you stole our blood. That's weird. Yes, that is very weird. That's... Well, uh, yeah, I stole your blood as part of a new project. See, 
I realize that there is a, a disease that infects most of the fish of Bikini Bottom. I had that little disease, but it's gone away from my body, and now I'm loo very, very low on it. And I started sealing out other people's. And I figured out through research that if I get enough, I could become ginormous like I've always wanted. That is also very disturbing. Yes, well, see, I'm here to tell you that I've stolen pretty much half of your blood. Patrick, wouldn't we be dead if he stole half of our blood? Yeah, wouldn't we? I, uh, I'm not really sure. Explain, Plankton. Well, I did steal half your blood, and so, uh, yeah, you're probably feeling a little bit nauseous and a little bit woozy, right? Kind of. What about you, Patrick? This room is shiny. Uh, what was that laser? It was me coming through the teleporter. Well, Plankton, I'm assuming you've already injected our blood into yours. No, oh, no. Your blood's still somewhere in the chum bucket. I think it's in one of my old laboratories. Alright, Plankton. Patrick, you know what we have to do now, don't you? Uh, let's get naked. Patrick, why are you repeating old lines from some of our older episodes? I don't know. Well, that's not what I was thinking, Patrick. You know what we have to do? Um, go away and pretend this never happened? No. Patrick, we have to stop Plankton and get our blood back. I don't really think we need it. I mean, I think I saw this on TV once. You could just have some cookies and, like, orange juice, and then you'll get the blood back from eating, drinking liquids. Well, it doesn't even matter anyway, you stupid starfish. I'm going to have to make sure that you guys don't get your blood back. So, with all that being said... I'm going to explain something. What? Even if I don't have your blood, I could still become ginormous. I've kidnapped, killed, or mutated dozens and dozens of fish in Bikini Bottom. Did you see my freezer? Did you see all the crabs that were in my freezer? Oh yeah, I thought you were. I thought that was what you used to make chum. <laughs> see, that's what a normal imbecile like you guys would think. But that's not it. I'm using their blood. I'm also using blood from other fishes. I saw a bunch of mutated fish with crabs on top of their heads. They tried to attack me. I've stripped their skin and I've stripped their blood from their body. And they became mutated zombies. And I put it inside this giant machine I'm standing on. So if I jump in that hole in the middle, I will become ginormous. Patrick, come here. Where are you? Oh. Shh, be quiet. Yes, you two can whisper all you want. I have an idea. We have to make sure that he doesn't fall in the middle of the thing and become giant. Okay, how? I don't know. Try running at him. Try running at what? Just, just uh, charge! Uh, ah, there's a shield around him. Let's keep trying until we eventually do it. <laughs> <laughs> you imbeciles, you aren't going to break my shield. <laughs> oh yeah, what about now? Ow, that hurt. Ow, ow, ow. He's not budging, Patrick. Um... I don't know. Stop it out! Stop it, SpongeBob! That's not fair. You're too much tall you're so much taller than I am. Wait till I become giant and then we can talk about being fair. How giant are we talking about here? Are you gonna be like our height? No. I'm about as tall as the chum bucket. Hey <laughs> you know in all this time you could spend talking to us, you could be jumping in the hole. 
Fair point. I'm with, I'm with Patrick on this. You could have jumped on the hole. Of course you can't now, because we're, we're basically cornering you. Yeah, so I can see that. Hmm. You could still escape from behind. Patrick, don't give him the freaking idea! Don't give him that idea, Patrick. Uh, well, where'd he go? I'm right here. Not! <laughs> Imbeciles. <laughs> it's so funny, because Plankton thinks he's actually going to turn giant. I don't yeah, know. he can't even... Yeah, in fact, he's too big to crawl out. What? Oh my! Ah! Ah! Those are some giant antlers. Yes, and I'm still growing by the minute or hour. So do you really want to think about stopping me now, SpongeBob? You can go get your blood, by the way. I don't really need it anymore. I mean, I could still use more. Because the more, more blood I get, the more giant I get. Patrick, what are we going to do? He's still growing. Um, we plug up the hole. The hole? I mean, this yeah, the thing... hole he's in. Yes, yeah, that hole. How would that stop? He would bust through it. Oh, I'm all out of ideas. Well, I have an idea. Ooh, what is it? Why would you ask him that, Patrick? He's the bad guy. Well, here's the idea. I'll give you a chance to try and stop me. See those rooms down there? Those little doors? Yeah. You see them, right, Patrick? Uh, there are a lot of doors. Yeah, just fall th go through any one of them and I'll, uh, I'll teleport you to a room in the chum bucket that you can use to go get weapons to try and kill me. I don't want to kill you. I just want you to stop trying to steal the formula. This is what it's about again, isn't it? Uh, Patrick, don't leave yet. Pat. Well, Patrick's gone. Yes, so... What were you saying? This is what it's about. All you want to do is do this so you can steal the formula again, am I right? Well, yeah. <laughs> I mean, what is Crabs going to possibly do this time? Is he really going to come up with some gadget to stop some 50-foot tall plankton from destroying his little treasure chest or whatever the heck the Krusty Krab is? And licking his stupid sign as a spatula or a, 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 a lollipop or something? Look, I'm just going to go try and get that weapon, but I don't want to kill you. Yes, go. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Plankton, Plankton, this is not a room, this is not the chum bucket! Where did he send me now? Oh, what the heck? Ow! Hey guys, look, it's Spongebob! Um, hello? Fish, staring me down? This one's blinking at me. Very, very fast. Uh, where am I? Hello? Hi, SpongeBob. Larry the Lobster? Aren't you gonna race? I race? Race what? I can't even drive. What is this? What do you mean you can't drive? This is getting weird. Mr. Krabs? Why are you here? I thought you were in retirement. I guess I have to race? I don't know what this is. Can someone help me out here? Dude, you're supposed to be in the race. You're racing this other fish today. Who? Bubble Bass? I'm racing Bubble Bass. He's already in the blue car. He's waiting for you, dude. Get in the car. Oh... Okay, but I don't even have my license. We know you don't have your license, SpongeBob. You're just supposed to race. It's a drag race, and it's inside of a closed environment, so it doesn't really matter if you don't have a license. It's not illegal. I need to find Patrick. I don't know where he is. Well, if you're going to find your friend Patrick, can't you just do the race first? 
Fine, I'll do the race first. On your marks. Get set. Go. I got you, Bubble Bass. I'll win this race. Oh my god! Hmm. Huh. That doesn't look too good. To downtown. But first... This looks like a job for... Starfish Man! Away! Huh. Good thing I, uh, traded in my crowbar for a laser sword at the pawn shop. Alright, time to jump over this fire. Leave of faith! Alright, let's see what's over here. I hear I hear creatures. Oh yeah, those are cre those are monsters. I have a laser sword. I did eat my laser sword that I got at a pawn shop. Hopefully it doesn't. I think that guy's frozen. Hey, lasers. Sending you all to Finland. Where's your leak, ma'am? This is my time. What? It... Alright. Uh, I guess I'll go in here. Oh, there's a way up. This convenient stack of crates. Ooh, window. Locked. Also locked. Gotta get down. Locked. Locked. Hmm. Ooh, boards. It won't break. I'll take the med kit. Good thing I also stole back the crowbar. How do I get out of here? I know, I can just squeeze through the boards. I hear beeping noises that are bad. The computers. There's Nothing, and then... Roof doors locked, and... Anywhere else I can go? Uh, let me in! 
Yay! Those guys are making weird popping noises. Um, the bridge. Huh. You think more of those weird monsters would show uh, up for some more? Ac oh, hey, they did. I think some of them might have just died. I don't know. All right, let's get out of here. Hit, hit. Oh, Patrick, man. Yeah. Oh, oh, hey, God, camera guy. Yeah. Yeah, my name is Starfish Man. Did I say Patrick Man? Yes, but my name is Starfish Man. Oh, uh, Patrick Man sounds like the name of a stupid SpongeBob episode that everyone hated. Huh? <clears throat> uh, race track. Ooh, I want peanuts. Well, this jab gets him. It's silly. How do you keep jabbing him? I'm coming, peanuts! So who's ready for me to start driving again? No one's ready. We've seen you beat everyone. Bubble Bass, that security guard. That poor kid that you almost ran over, and then bought him an ice cream, and then ate the ice cream, and then threw the cone in his face, and then, yeah, we get it. Does anyone else want to race me? Sandy, please. I don't think so, Spongebob. Does anyone want to race? Derpfish, do you want to race? Blink, blink, blink my leg guy, do you want to race? Child that I I bought ice cream for. Do you want to race? Get away from me. Okay. No one wants to race. I'd race, but I experience high tide. Oh. The heck was that? Anyway, if no one else wants to race, I guess I'll just have to prove how fast I really am. See you noobs later. Which brings a lot of spot bomb. Uh, okay, well that's. Oh god, my car's on fire. My car, it's on fire, guys. <laughs> but I'm alright. Just in case you're worried about me, this pretty face is still alive and kicking. I need a new car. Can I use someone else's car? Okay, this one should work. Okay. No. Don't no 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 Well at least I have a repair kit Am I going the right way? Oh yeah I'm going the right way. Let's see if I go Let's see how fast I can go now. I don't even have my license. This is the best thing ever. I'm crashing into things and it's so much fun, but it's so bad. I've never been the bad kid for once. It's time that I start changing my ways. If only with Patrick here to see how cool this really is. Oh my god! I hate those speed things. Ow! Ow! Okay, my car is doing black soot. 
I'm going to crash. Ah! All right. Well, that was fun, guys. I enjoyed racing and beating all of you. But now that my car's destroyed and that one's almost destroyed and I don't want to use any of those other crappy cars that I lost races to, I think that's going to call it a day. Call it a day? You've been here for 12 hours. We've been standing here through the night. And there's an attack in Bikini Bottom. An attack? Yes, haven't you heard? No. There's a giant monster attacking downtown Bikini Bottom. It's all over the news, man. It's crazy. Wow. They said it's Plankton because he's been throwing down mutated fish all over the city. But some weird pink pile of bubblegum has been trying to stop it for hours. And he's on his way here. Patrick. Patrick's on his way here. That's terrific. I just have to wait for him. Wait till he sees all my, uh, my sweet racetrack skills. Does anyone know more about this attack situation going on in Bikini Bottom? Anyone? No, but there's a Humvee pulling up. Where? I don't see a Humvee. They're, they're, they're trying to get out of this stupid Humvee. Why was this? Ugh, I just want to get over to SpongeBob Humvee. Oh. Patrick? Hey, SpongeBob. Oh, come over here. Patrick, what's going on? There's people telling me there's some sort of giant monster attacking the city. Oh yeah, it's Plankton. Where else do you think I got that Humvee? What does that have to do with Plankton? I stole it from the army that's trying to take him down so I could find you. Oh. Well, where, where were you? We got separated back at the chum bucket. Well, I went through this destroyed part of Bikini Bottom and fought a bunch of those weird crab fish monsters. Oh. Okay. Well, Let's uh, go stop Plankton. Well, don't you want to know what I did? You started? Don't you want oh, to know? Oh, hi, Sandy! Hi, Patrick. You want to know what I did while you were fighting off those monsters? What? I raced all of these people, and I beat them all. Sandy thinks she's so good at karate, but I beat her in racing. Look at all these cars. These are all the cars that I beat everyone in. This is Bubble Bass's over here. Where is Bubble Bass? I think he said he was going to go try and talk to Plankton about buying the Krusty Krab or something. I don't know. And there's my car over there with the black soot and smoke coming out of it. Well, that's my second car. I had a really fast car. But, yeah. All right. Thank you, everyone, for trying to race, but ultimately failing, because I'm so much better than you, because Spongebob is Spongebob. Bye, Sandy. Uh, bye, citizens of Bikini Bottom. Stay safe, and I'm sorry for whatever happened to you, and I'm sorry for um, eating your ice cream. Let's go, Patrick. I'll drive us back in the Humvee. All right. Back to Bikini Bottom we go. To stop <laughs> like that... Do you know your yeah. way back? Kind of. That's reassuring. Let's go off to Bikini Bottom. So how yeah. tall is Plankton? Because I saw him get giant before we were separated, but how tall is he really now? I think I heard a Gerald say he was like 60-something feet. Oh, no. Off into the sunset to stop Plankton! Ah. Yeah. I think you hit the camera, Patrick. Who put a camera in the middle of the road? Who knows? Why is the sky all of a sudden red and the sun is yellow still? And why is my chair there? Patrick, you're progressively making this truck work. <sighs>
Patrick. E. Hey. All right, let's go. Patrick. Hey. Ah. Let's continue on foot. All right. Uh, SpongeBob, I remember there being a building in Bikini Bottom that had two big antenna on it. Or a giant eyeball. Oh, it's Plankton! I knew it. He resized himself. What are we gonna do, Patrick? Oh, I know. Let's go and step on him. Step on him? Oh, wait, no, he... Dang it, that normally works. Yeah, but now he can stomp on us. He's the equivalent of what we were to him once. I think I have an idea. Steal the Krabby Patty formula? Well, we could do that, considering he might do that himself. But, before we do that, I'm noticing that those mutated fish are on top of those buildings and skyscrapers. If we want to split up, I would say that you go into the city carefully, climb one of the buildings, take out the mutated fish, watch out for his giant planktonness, and I'll see if I can do something. Like, see if there's anything in that junkyard over there. Okay. Starfish man! Way! Alright, now that Patrick's doing that, this is going to be a mass suicide. There's no way we're going to take down this giant plankton. What do we got in here? All right, I need to find something that I can help Patrick. He's got the biggest job out of both of us. But what can I do? See if there's anything in that tower. Ah, Plankton's still huge. What the heck is that? That looks like a purple spaceship. Is it from Pizza Planet? What's that even from? Oh, let's see what the tags say on here. Shouldn't be that hard to fly. I mean, I don't even have a pilot's license. I don't have a driver's license. I mean, it should probably be a little bit hard to fly, maybe. But it says, Erkins shall live. Erkins. What is an Erkin? Where have I seen an Erkin before? I don't know. I better just get in it and not say anything. Come on. I didn't do all those iron bun workouts for nothing. Alright. It's got to sneak around so playing you can't hear me. I hear that Please. voice. Where is it coming from? Uh, definitely not anywhere that matters to you, Plankton. What is that noise? I'm hearing electric. Sounds like I need to investigate. I gotta hurry. I gotta hurry. Starfish man! Way. Uh, Patrick, this is the director talking. Uh, where are you going? I'm going up here. Isn't this You're, where the, no, where the other no, fish No, 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 oh, no, 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 no. Well, then where are No, they? no, 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 Patrick. You don't just fall off and die there. No. I guess we could. All right. Uh, for everyone watching, this is the director talking. Uh, Patrick is dead. Not not really. He's actually just knocked out because he fell off the building. So now we're going to have a really cool action scene with SpongeBob. 
Take it away, blue, I mean yellow sponge thing. Cut! Wow. This Urken ship is a lot easier to fly than I thought it would be. Now, let's see if I can do anything. Plankton's probably got indestructible skin. Patrick, come in, Patrick. I have a walkie-talkie. Made out of bubbles. Boys. Oh, hey, SpongeBob. I fell off a building. Up. Uh, are you okay? Patrick, are you okay? Yeah. Okay. Uh, is there anything you could need me to do? Uh, Plankton's indestructible. I probably can't shoot. Get rid of the rest of the monsters. What monsters? The ones on the roof. Oh, those monsters? You mean the mutated yeah. fish? Yes. Alright, I got it. Dang it, I missed. Uh, why does it keep glitching? Die, mutated fish. I got one that was down here on the ground. That's okay. And now I crush it you! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Stop crashing, SpongeBob! Alrighty. Alright, SpongeBob, did you get them all? I think I got him, yeah. Alright, now you should try taking out Plankton, all, all Kelp Kong style. Kelp Kong! Ah! Ah, that hurt. Where's Patrick? Ah! Oh. Ah. 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 How are we gonna take out that giant plankton? We ask him nicely. Well, I did like the kamikaze Kelp Kong thing you came up with. I guess we could try asking him nicely. Plankton! Play dead. Who dare talks to me in their mediocre little voice? I hear more mutated fish! Patrick! I don't have a weapon! Ah! Ah! Starfish Fenway! Thank you. Play dead, we've come to bargain! Have you ever seen Doctor Strange, Patrick? No. Spoiler alert. Play dead! We come to bargain! You've come to die, Spongebob and friend. No, I've come to bargain. What do you want to bargain me with? Leave Bikini Bottom now. Or suffer the consequences? Was that asking nicely? Kind of. Well, you could have just asked nicely for me to leave, and I probably would have. But now, since you've threatened me, I have no other choice but to destroy the rest of Bikini Bottom and steal that frickin' formula. So get out of my way, because right now I can just crush the two of you. Bar uh, Barnacles! Fish paste! What are we gonna do, Patrick? It's not like going to the top of that cliff. Hide up this mountain! It's not Hide like, up this mountain! It's not like going to the top of that cliff is gonna solve our problems. We could hide up here. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I found a cave. Hey! Looks like Jellyfish Caverns. In fact, that I think it is Jellyfish Cavern. Hey, I found the solution to our problems. Is it sit around and die? Nope. It's two spaceships. That's impossible. I already destroyed the spaceship that I found in the junkyard. There are two other ones up here on top of the cliff. Where are you? Over here on the other side of the cliff. I see. What two spaceships, Patrick? Oh! And they're conveniently colored in the way that we are, except you're not red. You think of what I'm thinking, Patrick? I once ate red hair dye. What? My insides are red because I once ate red hair dye. That's amazing, Patrick. 
Um, you think of what I'm thinking? Kelp Kong? Is that what we were gonna... I mean, we, we, take, we take these and we shoot a plankton. Sounds like a plan to me. I'm glad you actually got that. Remember the last time I asked you if you were thinking what I was thinking? Do you remember what your response was? No. Ugandan monkey shoes. Oh. Oh. Asking, like, asking people if they know the way? No, not that stupid thing. Anyway, let's just do this bombing run, like Star Wars. Does this thing have guns? Oh, you can bet it has guns! It does. Let's get this! Yeah. Die! Die! I don't even... I don't even care if you die anymore. I was, like, kind of skeptical about you dying, but now I want you to die. Come on, Patrick. We gotta penetrate the skin. You're starting to bleed a little bit. You guys will uh, never no, win. Uh... Shoot his eyeball. That's probably his weak point. I... Oh, God. Ah. Uh... Yeah. They'll never win this, SpongeBob. I'm assuming that's who's inside those ships. You shot me, you idiot! Sorry, SpongeBob! Ah! They well, not that my ship's destroyed. Wait, is, there's another one right there. What the heck? Why is this convenient? Convenient. Patrick, you can do this! Uh. uh how you like that, Plankton? It does nothing to me except the eyeball thing is kind of making my eyes feel strange. Patrick, just stay here and just keep shooting. I'm not flying around, even though it looks kind of cool. <laughs> you really think you're going to just stop me by doing this? The least thing you're going to do is make me feel small again. Even then, I can still get the formula. That's it. I've come to the conclusion that flying around makes it look cool. Sure. Ring. What? Ray. I found an option on the blasters that says Sharing Ray. No, Patrick, no! Even if he shrinks, that's even worse, because then we won't be able to find him. Well, then at least he won't be destroying Bikini Bottom. Patrick? What? I'm warning you. Patrick, don't make me turn these fires on you. I wasn't going to use the Shaw Ring Cray. Alright, as long as you're being honest with me, where's my ship? No, shippy. Yeet. Fire it well! I don't even care. I was skeptical about killing him and now I don't even care. I think I already said that though. <laughs> you guys are trying to kill me. Ah, this is cute. This is like the time that Karen almost wanted to kill me, but she couldn't because I was more powerful. Patrick, this isn't working. We have to find something with rockets or something. Let's land these ships and meet up somewhere. Go to that okay. spot where we got the ships and then find a cave. Few more shots in. Patrick, screw the shots. Patrick. SpongeBob, where's the where's the cave? Go back to the cliff where we got the ships, and then look for two greenish lights, and meet. Go inside. Hopefully, he finds his way. There's a campfire in here. We can warm up. Because of the rain, is making us cold. <sighs> I'm walking around the cliff and I don't see anything. You'll find it, trust me.
Uh, oh, I found it. All right. Come to the very back of the cave. And you're a man. Why are you a man? You're a freaking man. You're an old so man. Sorry, you. What? Yeah, so are you. I I'm a man. Yeah. You know what I'm thinking? What? Wait. We said that we were, we both look like men, right? Yeah. Director, now is not the time. Do not play that music. Now that we're men. Thank you. Okay, let's let's stop the director from recording real quick, and let's turn back in to see people. Okay, now that I turn around, we should be sea creatures. Okay, so, Patrick. I did sleep with your wife. Uh, <laughs> no, Patrick, really, I'm sorry, okay? It's just, it was writing on the wall, okay? It's writing on the wall. Okay, so what were you talking about? We need to find a way to stop Plankton. How? Well... Do you think there might be any ships inside the city that have rockets on them or something? We could use some rockets. What the? Is that a rocket launcher I mean, like... coming out of your freaking face? Yep, I swallowed it one time. So you can just bring it out at will? Yep. Did you swallow that during the battle for Bikini Bottom? Yep. Oh. So you're telling me that you've had a rocket launcher in your mouth, in your face, all this time, and you decide now to use it? Yep. Well, shoot, Patrick, let's go. We can kill Plankton. Get a shot at the eyeball, though. Don't just fire at okay. the body or something. Here we go. Stretch. Or whatever they say. What are we stretching to? I don't even know what. What you're does that even about. mean? I don't know. I wonder where Plank. I mean, I wonder where Squidward is during all this. Or crabs. I think he's at home. Hopefully they're safe. Okay. Plankton. 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 I have an idea, Patrick. Patrick. I'm gonna what try. And, I'm gonna try and make a truce with them. And when he says, okay, you shoot him in the eye. Okay. Come with me. Plankton. 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 What is it, SpongeBob? You're ruining my conscience. I... Okay, uh... Uh, uh... I'm sorry. And Patrick, sorry for shooting you with those spaceships. Ah, uh, now you come to apologize. I'm here to inform you, SpongeBob, that it's too late to apologize, because, well, I really don't care about your apology. Um, Patrick, shoot him. Okay. What the? Ow, what is that? Rockets that won't go into his eye. Did you just, you just waste our last rocket? Yeah, that was all of them. Looks like you suck. I hope you know that feels like nothing. It just feels like there's an eyelash in my eye. Oh, hey, I just remembered I borrowed this from Gurr. No! I'll take him out. I did not expect him to die. Plankton? Plankton? I think I killed him, Patrick. Okay. That's not a good... I mean, it's kind of a good thing, I guess. Patrick, where are you? I'm right behind you. Oh. Hey, where'd Plank to go? Up, uh, I think that's him right there. 
Hey, Black Dead, how many fingers am I holding up? I don't know. I'm going all over the place. Yeah, we No, have... the answer is one. I only have one finger. Well, can you guys help me? I'm, like, kind of stuck. Is this how we're going to carry him to jail? Nah, I think we should just leave him. That seems like enough torture. I mean, his head is literally contorting out of proportion. Why? And now it's Oh, not. he stopped. He's frozen. With all the police? Look at that. He's just a frozen ice ball. It's adorable. Let's go call the police and celebrate with Krabby Patties at the Krusty Krab. The Krusty Krab is destroyed. Okay, Krabby Patties. Uh, Patrick, I think we're gonna have to rebuild the Chum Bucket or the Pat the the the, the Krusty Krab since we're in charge of it now. Oh yeah. So yeah, we're gonna have to try and find enough money to see about that, but uh. Yeah. You could sell the spaceships. Good thinking, Patrick. Wow. Fancy living, here we come. La 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 la. What a day, Patrick. We just stopped a giant plankton threat thing. Yeah. Why hey, look, there's the sales guy. Why were you walking like a crab? I don't know. Hey guy, are you a salesman? Yeah, I, I want to buy some stuff. Hey, we have a we couple have... spaceships. Would you like to buy yeah. those? Yeah, I'll buy them for nineteen million dollars. Sold. Where's the money? I don't know. Right there. You think this is more than enough to fix the Krusty Krab? This is not even 19 million dollars. This is 90 million dollars. So more than enough? More than This is not even 90 million dollars. This is 990 million dollars. No, no, no. This is a billion dollars. There's a note here. For defeating the giant plankton... The citizens of Bikini Bottom. Yay, we got more than enough. A billion dollars. Yeah. It'll only take like a hundred million to rebuild the Krusty Krab, which is conveniently in the background over there across from the chump bucket. But anyway, uh, Patrick, what do you want to do with the rest of the money? Hide it from Mr. Krabs? Yeah, but he doesn't really come around any much. I mean, he usually just stays inside of his giant house over there. Redecorate the Krusty Krab? Yeah, we could do that. In our own image. Or would you rather just have it... I think we should just have it be... Uh, Patrick, more money's coming. I think we should just have it uh, be... Um, Patrick, more money is falling from the sky. I think we should just have it be... Um, that's like a trillion dollars right there. I think we should just rebuild it in the same way it was. Okay, and then maybe we could go back to that fancy ship in a bottle restaurant? Yeah. Or we like could we become door to door ch chocolate, chocolate bars. bars. We, yeah, we, we, we could become door to door chocolate bar salesmen. We already work at the Krusty Krab. Yeah, but it pays minimum wage. Except it doesn't really for me, because I get 10 bucks an hour. But yeah, let's just let's just do that. No, no chocolate bar salesman. We'll just go out and eat. Yeah. Should we go get those old women that we went on the dates with, or should we get someone else? We could become. We could form. We could. We could. We could get all of our friends back together and just go out and have a nice dinner date with all of our friends, like Sandy and Squidward and I don't know crabs, I guess. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, but maybe sometime in the sequel, because the director says we're running out of time in this movie. Oh, uh, okay. 
So, uh, yeah, I guess we'll just uh, leave the money out here for anyone to take and go inside and nap since we did all that work. What if someone takes it? Let's put them all in our pockets. Okay. Uh... Ah. Where are we? Are we Wait, dead? This is Volcano Island. Why are we here? What was a portal? What was a portal to this place doing in my house? I don't know. Patrick, stay away from that. Oh god. The camera, are you okay? Camera. The camera fell, Patrick. Hey, where's that? Hey, where's that beardy crab guy? Beardy crab guy? Yeah. You mean Uriah? I don't know. Oh, yeah, that was his name. Uriah. Hello? Is anyone home? Oh, hey, what's this piece of paper here? Possible locations of Gur. This island, this island, this sea fort. This island. I don't know. Wait, there's a note on Uriah's desk. I'm gonna read it real quick. And I also am starting to not be able to breathe. Is there water around here? Oh, there's some water over here. Okay. What, Bob? Gone with what Tim. What does the note say? Gone with Tim and Dan and... Zim, be back soon. I wonder if they're out looking for Gur. Yeah, and what's Gur doing on an island? I don't like know. Like I think one time, I think I was watching his videos. There was this weird his videos on YouTube. There was this weird goat thing. Wait, Gur does videos on YouTube. Yeah. Uh, so I guess we should just stay here and wait for them to come back. Yeah. I'm gonna get in the water, because I want to take a dive. Yay! Oh god, 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 it's cold. It's very, very cold. It's very cold. Hey, SpongeBob, what's an XJ9? XJ9? Is this here? XJ9... Went out to get groceries. We'll be back in like 30 minutes. I don't know. What does that do? I don't know. I guess we wait. Think of what I'm thinking. What? No, not Ugandan monkey shoes. All hail the magic conch! He didn't do the... Bob? Bob? Bob?
SpongeBob, away! The magic conch says to do nothing. I don't feel so good. Can you see what's wrong with me? Karen? Oh, what's the use? Type that. What? I know what's wrong with you. Oh, what do you know, computer? I know that you have a rare kelp disease. Kelp disease? Yeah. You're dying. You'll probably only have like a month left to live. Are you serious right now, computer wife? Sorry. You're not worried about me or anything. You're just so calm and happy friendly that I'm gonna die within a month. Oh well, I guess I deserve this. <laughs>